My name is Sean Allen, and I've lived here at PAL uh, nine years. Well, I'm uh, Jenny Shaw, and I came to PAL three years ago. Well, my name is Lorna Schwenk, and I've been here since the beginning, since we moved in in the end of May 2006. Well, it's a community. It's a community of people with similar interests, similar backgrounds, similar experience. It's like, I don't know, moving into a development around a golf course with a bunch of golfers. I mean, it's the same thing. Um, it's a very creative community. A whole series of events in my life uh, kind of led me to living on my own and, uh, and uh, the opportunity to move in here came, so I grabbed it. It's been a ball. I'm more excited about my artistic expression now than ever before. This being here with all these different, very interesting and creative people, a lot of them who were performers before are now doing more visual arts. And we inspire each other. And just having the beauty here, the garden, the, uh, the freedom of having a wonderful, safe, beautiful home has certainly inspired me to further heights. I was so relieved to be accepted at Tepal and uh, I found this extraordinary community of people um, like me. It's just the most amazing place to live. I had lived in co-ops before and communal housing but this is a really genuine community of like-minded people and we're so lucky to have the theatre and this beautiful garden. Um, there's always something going on and you can join in and volunteer. We can go to the plays, we can go to soup suppers on Monday, which is a communal meal that we have every Monday and we all contribute to it. It's not only a creative community, it's also a sanctuary. You know, Vancouver is getting increasingly expensive to live in and a lot of senior, senior people in the performing arts, creative people, are being forced to move out of the city and uh, further and further away from where all the creative endeavors are. This is remarkable to be able to, to be right in the city. Yeah, I went through some very dire uh, physical challenges and medical uh, health challenges before I moved in here. And coming here and feeling so secure and supported by just very uh, dramatic and interesting and um, artistic other people helped me to feel there was a sense of community, so I recovered whatever um, emotional, physical, and medical problems I had before just cleared up because of coming here. <laughs> we think of PAL performing arts, we do think of theatre, but it's not only people from with a theatre background. Uh, it's also musicians and artists, like visual artists, uh, people who work for CBC, people from a variety of backgrounds so you know there's there's always something that they're contributing as well whether it's a concert that they're singing at or a, a painting class or a movement class um, so everyone's using their, their different skills to contribute to the building and to contribute to everybody's uh, well-being in the building it's just uh, a marvelous place